feel very Madonna right now for some reason. Anyway, hey guys, it's Jen from Beauty Riot X. So today we have a, I have a review video on the brand called, I don't know how to pronounce this, Monat, Monet, Monet, I don't know, but it's M-O-N-A-T. So I have the shampoo here, which is the Renew shampoo and the Restore Leave-In Conditioner, both from the Balance Collection. From my understanding, I was sent these products first off to try and review, and this is a brand like um, that you would sell from home. So, and I've actually heard some good things about this brand, but I'll tell you what the claims are for the shampoo and leave-in that I have, and we'll go from there. I did also get a mask too, but I don't have that to show you because I didn't actually use it enough. So I'm gonna, I'll put the updated mask review in the description box below when I actually do end up using it. So, for the shampoo, it's a salt and sulfate-free hydrating cleanser that improves the moisture balance of the hair and restores youthful vitality. For the leave-in conditioner, designed to revive each strand and restore, what did I just say? And restore lost essential nutri nutrients geez, from the scalp. Leaves fragile hair silky smooth with no flyaways. How they work. Delivers maximum moisture, balance, and shine. Boosts natural hydration without weighing hair down. Leaves hair soft, clean, and manageable, and helps prevent loss, hair loss while stimulating growth. Let's start with the shampoo. Now, I'm going to, I'm going to read, to, now, I've said this in a few videos, and I don't say this to be like, oh, look at me, and like, be all haughty. I just say this so I feel that I'm qualified to make these statements. So I am a licensed professional. I've been doing hair for over 15 years, and... I feel I know how to shampoo my hair and someone else's. And I think I'm a pretty good authority on shampoos. Now, this is how you're supposed to use this shampoo. Massage throughout wet hair and scalp. Leave on two to three minutes, rinse thoroughly, and repeat. For maximum results, use daily and follow with, I think it's Monat, I don't know how to pronounce this brand, Monat Replenish Mask. Okay, so what I did was I used each product separately for an extended amount of time because, and then at, at the end I did actually use them together. Now, I, because I wanted to see how each one worked. I didn't want one overshadowed by the other. So the shampoo, I did not like at all. Like, oh my gosh, this was just not good with my hair. Now, again, disclaimer, I, I'm sure people love this stuff and it works amazing for them. For me, it did not work at all. This left my hair so heavy and it felt like, it just felt like it, there was tons of buildup in my hair. So the first few times I did use this as directed. Then I used it as a normal shampoo to see maybe if that's why. Maybe it was just hold, maybe my hair was just holding on to the shampoo and from the leaving in two to three minutes deal that it's supposed to do. But again, even when I just did the wash out, rinse out, whatever, it still just made my hair feel so like heavy and dirty and like, I couldn't even run my hands through it when it was dry. It was so weird. And I feel as though, you know, there's only so many ways to use a shampoo. So I couldn't have been doing it wrong both ways. For me, this was a mess. It just did not go with my hair. This retails for $35. So the second I tried, I really did, I, I did like, it was a good, it's a nice leave-in conditioner. Um, conditioners tend to just make my hair feel heavy, like they don't make it feel clean. And I don't like to wash my hair every day, first off, because it's very dry, so the more you wash it, the dry it's gonna be. And I have, you know, vibrant color in my hair, and again, the more you wash it, the more it's gonna fade, so I don't wash it every day. So I like leaving conditioners because they're light, they're made to be left in your hair, so they're made to be lighter, whereas sometimes conditioners in the shower that are made to be washed out end up leaving buildup in your hair. You don't wash them out completely. So I was excited to try this, and I did like this, you know, it made it feel nice. It wasn't heavy. I, you know, I started with just using a little bit. A little goes a long way, so this will last you a really long time. And this retails for $33, I believe. The shampoo is $35. And you get, you know, four and a half ounces in this. So again, this will last you forever. The shampoo is eight ounces. And again, this was nice, but in order for me to want to shell out that kind of money and order it and have to wait for it to come, I have to love it. So just for that reason, I, I probably wouldn't purchase it myself. Now, the mask, as I said again, I haven't used enough to have an opinion on it, but I will and I'll update it in the description box below. But like I said before, like huge disclaimer for everything, everybody on YouTube always has stuff they don't like. Everybody's different. We have different needs for different things, whether it be makeup, skincare, hair care, whatever. You know, this just didn't work for me in particular. Like I said, the leave-in was great, but because I do this for a living, I can 
find other really good things for, you know, a bit cheaper and that I can, you know, get right away. I do, ha I have heard a lot of good things. The girl who sent me this, you know, swears by it, and I'm sure if she didn't like it, she probably wouldn't sell it. So I'm sure this, you know, stuff works great for a lot of people. It just doesn't, it just wasn't completely a win for me. But anyway, that was it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye, guys.